first, uh, you start with the short jumps. Gauge the distance carefully, and... Whoa, what? Oh! Don't take gravity too lightly, or it'll catch up with you. Hey guys and girls, this is Slipknot from Slippy Slides and welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you coming to watch this video and if you do enjoy it, please hit that like button. I'd appreciate that too, you know, because uh, that's why we do these uh, videos and spend a lot of time on them for you guys and girls out there to enjoy. So if you do enjoy it, please hit that like button, I'd really appreciate it. So anyway, here we are in the reef on Destiny and this time I'm going to show you an awesome out the map glitch that you can do. Much, much better than the one where you get onto the the map and into a tiny little area that gets pretty boring after you've done it once really uh, this is a lot more fun to do although it is a bit more difficult as well uh, especially if you're trying to do this solo and even more so if you're a titan but we're going to get all the way out the map over there past those pipes that are on the wall that's what we're going to use to get out there so you need to get on this flooring that's stacked up against the wall there and you can do this by either going on top of that doorway and dropping onto it or you can do it the way I'm going to do it and just get on this whatever you want to call it and then just jump on top so once you're up here all we're going to do is a running jump and hopefully land on the very edge of that blue wall and then jump again on top of the doorway now I've only ever got this once to work and I've been trying ever since this map was released to do this since day one and I've only ever managed it once with a Titan. So there you go, it's bounced me off to the right. But the aim of the game is to get on top of that door. Now I do believe it's a lot easier with a Warlock or a Hunter on full agility. But the way I'm going to show you is also a lot easier, which is to have a friend in a fire team. So what I'm going to do this time is get onto this second doorway down from the end of the platform. And as you can see, my friend who I want to give a huge shout out to, Short Duck5793, he really helped me out doing this glitch and he stuck with me, even though uh, we did fail a few times at first, but it's all about practice, this sort of stuff, guys and girls. You've, you've just got to keep going with it and get your timing right. But massive shout out to uh, Short Duck, I really appreciate it, dude. So here it is in slow motion anyway, and once you've jumped, Short Duck's going to jump underneath me and I'm going to bounce off his head and land on the doorway just like that and like I said it does take practice this don't think that you can well I mean you might just be able to do it at first go but don't worry if it does take you a few goes uh, you've just got to stick with it but anyway once you're on this side uh, jump across to this platform that I'm on now and then crouch down and slowly walk off the end I nearly actually fell off there but you need to just slowly walk onto these pipes and then we need to jump over a couple of these sections so just be careful when you're doing this not to fall off or else you will respawn in the reef and you might notice when i'm jumping i'm getting to these bits that i suppose are supposed to hold the pipe to the wall get to the last one of them and that's where you jump from or that's where i do it from and we're nearly at the end now so you can turn around and give your friend a wave it's only fair that you do that being he's helped you out so uh, once we're at the end here, what we need to do is jump down and just go to the left. And you will go through the bit that you can see, but there's a pipe underneath that you can actually jump onto. So don't be worried, you won't fall through and you can run right to the end of this pipe. So I'm just going to get to this platform and stop there. And I'll just spin the camera around so you can see the view. And you can see right back inside the map. So it's pretty cool to come out here and do this. I hope you have fun trying this out for yourselves. You can actually drop down to the level underneath you as well. So there's some pipes down there and that flooring that you can get to. But just be warned, if you do do that, you will respawn down there if you die. So you won't be able to do this bit that I'm going to show you now. And just whilst I'm running back this way, I'd just like to say a big shout out to UBA Productions. They were the first ones to actually do this and uh, publish a video of it. So a big shout out to them. I kind of always knew it would work myself, but I never got round to doing a video of it. 
I was always trying to do it solo and it never quite worked out but first fur and they did it first so big shout out to them there's a lot of cool stuff you can find out here like this big floating jet engine that you can't actually normally see from inside the reef so I'm not sure why that's there and there's a few rooms that you can actually explore that I'm sure will open up at a later date like in the tower when they open the back room but I'm not going to show you those, you can explore those for yourselves because I don't want to spoil your fun doing this. This was brought to you by Slipmap from Slippy Slides. Thanks as always to my subscribers. You guys and girls make these videos worth doing. If you have enjoyed the video, please hit that like button, I'd really appreciate it. And I'll catch you in the next one. Take care people.